Joining us now is White House Press Secretary Robert Gibbs. Mr. Gibbs, good morning. How are you, sir? I'm well. This is an important milestone. It uh, can't be, uh, we can't uh, pass that by. But the fact remains is that as many as 100 civilians are killed every week still in Iraq. You have a government that, you have a elected representatives that have been, the election took place five months ago. They still can't form a government. Is Iraq right. ready to stand on its own? Absolutely. Iraqi security forces have been in the lead for quite some time. They provided security for the election uh, that was certified in June. The, as you mentioned in that piece, as Bill did, the vice president was over there uh, trying to get the government formed. Uh, last time it took six months uh, to form that government. I, I think we're making progress. The history and the future of Iraq will now be shaped by the Iraqis. Uh, and the president tonight will talk about the change in our combat mission uh, as we focus on rebuilding our nation here at home. The president goes to uh, Texas today to talk to veterans and soldiers. There are folks who have gone there on deployment after deployment after deployment. And some of them wonder this morning if their sacrifice has been worth it. Well, look, we should never uh, question the sacrifice uh, the president is in awe of the sacrifice that our men and women have made. Uh, thousands uh, that deployed will never come back. They paid the ultimate sacrifice in Iraq. They keep us safe and secure uh, all over this world, uh, all over this dangerous world every day. And uh, the president's going to take some time out of his day to make sure they understand how much he and others appreciate it. Meanwhile, 14 U.S. soldiers, uh, Marines, have been killed in Afghanistan just over the last couple of days. We have a horrible partner there in government in Hamid Karzai, who just fired the uh, corruption chief there. Is the president ready to say that uh, we've made progress in Afghanistan? Well, look, we have made some progress in Afghanistan, but as you mentioned, Harry, uh, it is slow going. We did not... Uh, get into the mess that we're in in Afghanistan overnight. Uh, we should understand that when the decision was made in 2003 to focus on Iraq, despite the fact that the 9-11 attacks came from Afghanistan, we made a conscious decision there to focus on a very different part of the world. We're having to make up for those resource decisions now. Uh, I do think it is important this president is, uh, is focused on making sure uh, that we have the resources that we need in Afghanistan. The president will talk tonight uh, about what we must do to ensure uh, that just as he kept his word in removing, beginning to remove our troops from uh, Iraq, he'll do the same in Afghanistan. And there is no doubt, Harry, that we are going to have to focus uh, the people and the, the government of Afghanistan in tackling and fighting corruption. Uh, that is crucially important to our mission there. Robert Gibbs from the White House this morning. Thank you.